like why would you send Harley Quinn on a full scale military mission? She is not to be trusted. <laughs> she can't be trusted. <laughs> also, Even the how useful like, is you know, she? Like, uh, but apparently very. The movie made her very useful, yeah. which was unrealistic. I don't think that baseball bat should have been nearly as effective as it was. No, it like like one hit can take off their heads. I'm like, these are weak monsters. The Enchantress has made weak monsters. <laughs> That's the real problem. Yeah. Yeah. She was just as effective as all the other villains. And it doesn't really make sense. Which, yeah. Compared to her abilities. Like. Yeah, it doesn't. Um. Just by having her fight regular people, would have been, I think, a little more realistic. If they'd been like Joker's henchmen, if it was Joker as the villain, like if it, it, they're Security guards or any, yeah, anything. Yeah, just yeah. people. Arkham's, Arkham Asylum guards. It's if something you, like that. You hit a person in the head with a bat. It's effective. They'll go down. Yeah. They'll go down. <laughs> as as easy as a bullet would take them down. But if they're like weird magic monsters who are all eyes or whatever, yeah. it, you expect different rules. You expect more resilient. That that Harley Quinn can just take them down one on one in basically unarmed combat, just with a big stick. Yeah. Like that's that's that doesn't speak well to our villain either. <laughs> Come on, let's go.